What's going on YouTube? It is your boy Chris back again with another video for you guys today. In this video, we're going to talk about Prime Icon Moments. It could be coming out soon. I'm not sure if it's going to be this Friday or if it's going to be next Friday. But what I can tell you is the dynamic images on the Prime Icon Moments have been updated. So we have literally every image at our disposal to look at. We don't have the player ratings. We don't have the stats. We don't have any of that stuff yet. But we do know uh, the dynamic images. So we know that it's coming soon. And what EA did earlier in the year is they kind of, they never put a full time date on like the icon moments coming out. They just said mid to late February, I believe. So this would make sense if it was coming out probably next Friday. I can't really see them doing it this Friday. The reason why I can't is because I feel like they would like to promote this a little bit more. So maybe I'm wrong in the sense that maybe today or tomorrow, depending on when you're watching this video, they put it a loading screen out. I don't know if they're going to do it this Friday because how long are you going to wait for winter upgrades and winter ones to watch? It's been already a week and a half from the uh, the deadline day for the January transfer window. So how much longer are you going to really wait for winter upgrades and ones to watch to come out? So I think that moment is going to be next week, which is why they said mid to late February. Because then it'll be around the 22nd, 23rd, somewhere around there for the moment uh, cards. So... We gotta talk about market movements when it comes to this kind of stuff. Um, in my opinion, before I show you some of the dynamic images on these cards, EA again did not confirm if they're gonna be a plus one, a plus two. They might just do based on whoever like they want to do. They might give Rio a 91, 92. It, it we're gonna be getting icon moments for every icon this year, not selective like last year. Remember, Nedvin never got one, Balak never got one, Rio never got one. We're going to get those icons this year for the moment. It's going to be a full promo. Um, again, though, I don't know if it's going to be a promo. I think it's just going to be put into packs. Um, because realistically, they're not going to be packable. In my opinion, the pack weight on Prime Icon Moments. I don't even see icons now, let alone Prime Icon Moments. They're going to be so rare the first day. Even the next couple weeks. They're going to be super, super rare. Even for like the, the smaller tier cards. Like I think Moments Van Nistelrooy. The Moments Balak. Like, any of these lower tier, not even lower tier, that's like mid-tier. None of those cards are going to be on the market, or they're going to be very, very expensive. So, I don't think you're going to see that many of them on the market first couple weeks. Um, now, it'll be interesting because they did something earlier in the year. I don't know if you guys remember this, but Ronaldo, Hullet, Eusebio, and Ronaldinho all got up, they got price range updates plus 15 million so it wasn't 15 million max it was like i believe for r9 they did 22 million and i think for Hullet they did like 17.8 million so maybe they were kind of experimenting to see what the community was thinking about that um i mean if you look at these prices ronaldo's 13.5 million and Hullet is 9.5 million okay you're not gonna see you're not going to see the moments cards even being close to these. You'll probably see moments Hullet, probably 12, 13 million, depending on if you give him a plus two or a plus three early on. Maybe extinct at 15, depending on what the price range is. Um, I'm thinking in terms of panic selling, there's going to be panic selling on a lot of the icons. So whenever they do decide to put that loading screen out, when they decide to announce it, you will see prime icons middle icons being panic sold you'll see the whole icon market just shake pretty much um you want to buy these the morning of like friday like the day of um when they're going into packs obviously the moments cards if these cards are getting panic sold that much to the point where this card's like 1.25 1.3 you really need to look at this card to buy if you want this for your team you gotta buy this i think before the promo starts because people are gonna see Rio Ferdinand's moments card, and it's going to be instantly 4 to 5 million coins. If Maldini, without the dynamic image or any of that stuff, if a 94 Maldini, who has not been as good this year as previous years, and I have not seen him as much as other years from the pros, like I haven't seen many people use this card, he is still 4.67 million, 4.5 million minimum on the market. So you could tell that these cards are going to be super expensive. I'm expecting Maldini to be 7 to 8 mil. I'm expecting R9. Like, if they put the price range at 20 million plus, then I could see him going to like 17 to 20 million. I could really 
see people just going nuts for that. Uh, again, Zidane. This is going to be the first year we have a Zidane. Maybe they put 98 overall or 99. You know, if you really want to juice up, okay, if they really want to go hard for this type of, like, um, not promo, but just this type of content that they're going to release, they're going to put plus twos and threes and plus, you know, maybe for the lower ones, you put plus ones. But even, like, a prime moments keen that we never got last year, you're going to see this card probably 1.5 to 2 mil the first couple weeks. I mean, if you look at his stats, if you give him, like, 76 pace, 75 shooting, 89 passing, 85 dribbling, 90 defending, 92 physical. That's a card that if people put a shadow on him, you're already giving him plus 80 pace. And this is what, I, I mean, he's going to be a 1.5, 2 mil card, I think. His skills and weak foot are awful, but I still think you're going to see 1.5 million minimum for him. We didn't get Balak last year. And Balak, again, is a card that if it's 91, I think it's like 1. something right now. What is he, 1.4? Yeah, it's about one four one zero. You're gonna see the moments. You're gonna see the moments. Balik probably be about three mil minimum because we didn't get one last year. So I think a lot of people are gonna want to try out Balik if he's a ninety two or a ninety three overall. Um, there's also gonna be position changes, guys. So there was rumors that Ronaldinho potentially can get a center attack in mid, a center attack in mid card. Now. If he does get a center attack in mid, I do expect this to drop maybe a little bit because I think a lot of people want to go get that center attack in mid. I think something that the community has kind of been complaining about a lot recently is Dino is great and he had a 95 moments last year, which he was probably the best, one of the best players in the game, top five, easily. They like to use him in the central position though because he does have, uh, he does have five star, five star, right? He has four star, five star. He's got the pace. That 95-96 at a cam position would be really, really nice for this card. Nedved, we never got him last year. There's rumors he can get a center attack in mid this year. Um, he's currently 799. I think I think Nedved would be like 2.53 million. Um, like I said, Rio is going to be four to five, easy. Uh, Maldini probably goes to seven. I'd say seven million. Vieira, uh, and this is just like like general price predictions. This thing, they, most of these probably won't happen. But we'll see, right? 3.91 for Vieira. Uh, he was a little bit low earlier today, like 3.5, 3.6. So he's now back up again. Uh, he'll probably be about 7 to 9 mil, I would say, like, eventually. Um, if we go and look at last year's icons, and I want to show you, because this could be like an overall um, just general discussion on the icon market. If we look at, uh, who do we just look at? We looked at Vieira, right? So early... And we're going to go take a look at the Generations card from last year. The Moments Hullet last year. Can we find it? No, can we not find Hullet? Wait, wait, wait. We have to go to FIFA 19, right? FIFA 19 players? Yeah, we do, we do, we do. Okay, we got to go to Icon Moments. And then we got to go to Price, I believe. Okay, so let's go to Price and just see like where some of these are. So, yeah, Vieira's 9.2. Obviously, this is FIFA 19, so it doesn't really matter. Um, But he never really dropped under... 5.9 i mean even towards the end of the game like in even in the middle he was really 7 to 8 million most of the time he even hit upwards of 9.9 .9 million 9.3 you look at the early stages he was really extinct people really kept this card extinct that's not what i think you're going to see with the zidane the Vieira, the uh ronaldinho the ronaldo the hullet those kind of players do sabio as well all of these kind of cards are going to be um at least seven to ten million quids minimum the top tier cards you never really saw him go under six unless it was this time which it was because probably everything was in packs so the game just got just got really boring at that point i think that was when the week after like august 12th i think the week before that they took everything back out of packs so people stopped playing the game so that would have made sense why he dropped off um so that's Vieira. now if i'm gonna show you some of the moments okay some of their dynamic images some of the ones that stand out to me Okay, Zidane, 97, 98 overall. He's going to be probably 15 million extinct unless they update the price. Uh, Van Nassar, okay. Thierry Henry, that's a pretty nice dynamic image. Steven Gerrard, we had one last year. Uh, this is Sol Campbell. Socrates, this philosopher right there. Ryan Giggs, even like the Ryan Giggs guys. If we go on back, if we look back at uh, FIFA 19, uh, Ryan Giggs. If we go take a look. At Ryan Giggs, 90, 
What was he, 90? Did he get a moments card last year? I forget if he got one or not. Where do I go here? I think I go... Do we go FIFA 19 and then Ryan Giggs. I'm sorry that I'm not even with the moment stuff. Is it not showing me the FIFA? Unreal. I wanted to see the FIFA, the FIFA 19. Can I look? Go FIFA 19. No, it's, why is it backing out? There we go. Ryan Giggs. So yeah, 93 moments car. Let's see what the lowest he's gone. Okay, so he was pretty much like originally 2.5 million on the Friday. Went all the way down to 1 mil by March 4th. So look at this right here. Pretty much a month. Like not even a month. Like a week and a half in. He's still at a million coins. Okay. He continues to drop. But he settles around 800. So he's really at 800 until April. And even hits upwards of 935 on April 14th. So you can see how even the Ryan gigs. The guys that don't even have much um, demand. Still keep up a price of 8 to 900k minimum. So these cards are going to be super expensive. You're not going to see many of these on the market. Uh, these were ghost cards last year. They they weren't barely on the market, especially this Ronaldo. I mean, I remember when like the first sighting of Ronaldo was like people just went nuts because they never saw that card on the market. Um, Dino I think was like six to eight million last year. Roberto Carlos would be a pretty nice card. Rivaldo, Raul. Did we get a Raul moments last year? I don't think we did. So that's gonna be a new one as well. Pep Guardiola obviously a new icon. Uh, Nedved, gonna get a new moments card. Paul Scholes, Patrick Vieira. That's a pretty nice dynamic for Patrick Vieira. Um, who else was good? Miroslav Klose, he's gonna get a dynamic for the first time. Michael Owens, first, uh, icon this year. Essien is gonna be like five to six mil. <laughs> I'm, t I'm telling you guys, if they give him a plus one or two, he's gonna be six million coins. There's no, there's no way he's gonna be under five. At minimum, I'd say. As, like I said, Michael Ballack. Uh, Van Basten, Desai. Desai, did he get a moment? I think he did get a moment last year. Overmars, I believe, had one last year. Garincha, first year icon, is going to be like 6, 7 mil minimum. Um, Figo, uh, I think we got Figo last year. I remember him. Yashin, Lauren Blanc. Kenny Daglish is going to be about 7, 8 million, I think, if he's a 93, 94. Uh, Kaka, first year icon, probably about 4 to 5 mil. Uh, John Barnes, he'll be getting one as well. So all of these guys are going to be getting first year um, dynamics. And some are going to have obviously repeat from last year. But di maybe different images. I'm not sure yet. Um, Frank Lampard didn't get one from him last year. So we're going to have one. He'll probably be about a million, 1.2, probably selling price. Um, so talking about the market. Okay. I really do think you guys should be looking at a lot of these icons. I think they're probably... The, the way that this is going to work is I think a lot of the primes... A lot of the middles are going to drop the second the loading screen comes out into that Friday. The second the moments come out, people are going to be like, uh, like, oh, we don't have the coins for these moments because they're like 6 million coins. You saw right there that gigs was 2.5 million on the Friday. So people are going to want to play Weekend League that Friday night, right? If they can't pack one of these cards, which they will be super, super rare. They'll be one of the rarest cards in the game. Um... Those prime icons are going to go back up again, in my opinion, because the gap between the moments and the prime is going to be too big to the point where this is going to rise with uh, the moments card being out. Now, I would also tell you guys that middle cards, middle icons are going to be going out of packs. So they might have an effect like the babies did where some may drop because they're just not really uh, usable or some will do really well. So for example, Cruyff's middle, okay, will go up a lot in my opinion because he's about 3.1 million, but this is a card that his moments card will be about 7 to 8. So him going out of packs plus his prime, which if I go look at the prime card, okay, and I bet you it's about, how much is the prime Cruyff? He's about 5.8, so there's a 2.6 million difference between the prime, which is a plus 3 over the middle. So... The middle is a 3.1, and then the prime is about 5.8, 5.9. So, the moments will probably be about 10 million first day. I, I think it'll be 10 mil, which means that this Cruyff is going to get panic sold, and then it's going to go back up in price, and the middle is going to go up as well. Ronaldinho, I think if people, okay, if people want to use a Cam Ronaldinho, I don't think that this card's going to get hurt. I think it'll go down originally. But since it's 2.5 million, and people do prefer this card um, because it's a center, center tech in mid, 
And the only other option they can use as a center attack in mid is this Dino because the first, the moments icon is going to be like 10 mil plus. Then you're probably going to see this card rise again as well. I do think you're going to see a lot of panic selling uh, like once the loading screen comes out or whenever they decide to announce it into the Friday. And then I do think you're going to see those cards rise again. The middle should rise out of packs. If you look at like Carlos Alberto here, we were talking about the babies a couple months back when they went out of packs. Um, they've kind of stabilized or kind of gone up actually because they are rare they're not getting supply anymore and it really is just you know supply and demand pretty much now is what's making these cards go up or down so that's pretty much all about the icons man i'd really really get on some of these um once they announce it that's when you want to start studying the price not to make coins on this just to if you want an icon for your team like a rio uh like a maldini like a ronaldinho like one of those kind of cards um even like your Balics, like those kind of cards are going to go up as well. I think Essien will probably rise a little bit because Essien again is about what? 1.5, 1.6 million. Um, let's see where he is. Yeah, he's about 1.64. So this card, if his, if his moments card is like 5, 6 million, there's too, there's a, too much big of a gap here between the prime and the moments. So you're going to see this card go up again, in my opinion. So Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys like this kind of content, make sure you guys do drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are newer around here. And I'll talk to you guys in a video soon. Peace out.